and we are back with another very exciting video for you guys to see and today I am going to do a review on our new water fountain. Yes that's right we went away from a dog bowl again and we have decided to use a water fountain. Now we've previously had a water fountain before which was quite a cheap one. I think we had that water fountain for about a year and when we were cleaning it out and changing around the living room one day we took the plug out and it literally just melted in front of our very eyes so we were like oh my goodness so we decided to try yet another water fountain and um, we've been stuck with a bowl we've been using a bowl for quite some time and because I have two dogs, it goes down quite a lot. So Jamie got this fountain from Amazon, but he first picked one up in Pets at Home, which was more for like cats. It was a lot smaller, same make, but he decided to return it and look for a bigger one. So he went to Amazon and he paid 28 to 30 pounds, I think, for it. So this is it here, as you can see in the background. This is the box, so it is a dog mate large pet fountain and when he showed me this I thought is that not going to be too big for the two of them and he says well when you've seen the one for the small dogs the gap for them to get the water was like really really small so we thought the bigger one would be better. So this is a large fountain and it is multi height drinking level so you can drink from two heights of it which is really good. It's 6 litres of water capacity, super quiet operation, dishwasher proof, suitable for cats and dogs and it has a 3 year guarantee which is really good. It is also veterinarian recommended for your pet's health and vitality. And on the back it just shows you a kind of demonstration on how to put it together and it also has um, multi height drinking stations, ramp produces water splashing, um, IPS isolated pump system for super quiet operation, low voltage power supply with a 3 meter 10 inch lead length so you can have it at a distance from where your plug is and it also has a polymer carbon filter for water purification replacement cartridges available so we can get replace replacements. It is easy to clean and dishwasher proof bowls. And inside, let me just see because I think there was a leaflet inside. We've still to look at how often we need to clean it out. Now I've cleaned it out today, just obviously for the purpose of this video, plus well it needed a clean out anyway because sometimes they get bits of food stuck to their tash and we need to clean it. But this is the wee booklet here. And the ladies are thinking they're getting something exciting, that's a shame. Um, that's just an information leaflet for different things. Instructions. Okay. Monthly maintenance. With one pet, we recommend that you replace the filter cartilage monthly. For two or more pets, you may, may need to replace the filter cartilage more frequent if it becomes clogged. A clogged filter cartridge will cause poor operation and premature pump failure. So we need to make sure we replace. Okay, cleaning. Let me see for the cleaning. It doesn't really say how often to clean it. Every couple of days or whatever, you know, clean it. And obviously we refill um, the water up if it gets down too low. And it also keeps the water quite cool for them, which is quite good. I have cleaned the fountain out for obviously the purpose of this video and obviously it needs a clean. So it's just to let you guys see what it comes with. So it comes with the plug-in adapter and it also plugs into this bit here. This top bit comes off and as you can see underneath the wee motor bit is there and it's also got wee suctions on it and you can turn the wee nozzle I think I'm guessing for the power. Oops, I just spilled some water. And then this is how it looks inside. So it does look a wee bit kind of complicated, but um, I'll show you guys how to put it together. Okay, so these are all the wee bits that it comes with. So you've got your filter and then you've just got your wee kind of sections to 
and um, basically fill in all these holes so that is the top bit that comes off and it obviously has the motor on it i'm going to put that to one side just now so all you really need to do is um put in the filter now it's got these we kind of i don't know if you're going to be able to see that it's got like wee black bits in it and it's just basically we, we kind of filter balls or something like that i don't really know and um, but all that does is you put that in so that slides in there and then you put that bit in the top bit and then i think that's how it works yep that's how it works and then what you do is you just put these in You put the slot these in, slot them in there, and then this bit will clip onto the top just like that. But if you hold on a wee second, I will go and fill it up with water and let you guys see what it looks like filled up. Now, as you can see, I have minimum, so this is the lowest it can go before it will stop working, but I fill it up quite. Um, full, I think as long as it doesn't go over the top of as long as it doesn't go over the top of this I think it's fine so I will be back in just a moment once it's filled there we are so that is it all filled up with water and then what we are going to do is we are going to basically plug this in and attach this on that is it and then all we do is just plug the two of these in, keep that behind there, push it back so that the dogs don't get to the wire. And all we do now is turn it on. And you'll see the water rise up and then fall down the wee bit for them to, it's like a wee fountain. There we go. Oh, isn't that beautiful? I've got a wee water feature in my living room. Okay, you guys, so as you can see, that was really easy to put up and basically fill up. Um, it is really, really good and it basically keeps the water cool and helps purify the water which i really really like given that the girls um, moustaches stain then we like to use purified water and that obviously helps purify so we really really like it and the dogs absolutely love it it took them a while to get used to it to be fair but um, they are used to it now they go up and drink from all the time they absolutely love it we just need to make sure that it is filled up enough and um, just kind of top it up every day and then clean it out every couple of days and then obviously we'll need to re replace the filter um, once that basically goes done but yes that is it so i will have the link down below to the amazon website that we got it from for you guys to have a wee look and that is us so give us a thumbs up if you like this video leave us a comment and as always please subscribe to our channel and i'll see you in the next video bye guys